way to Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree. I'm so excited. What a way to kick off spring, a trip to Dollar Tree. I think I need to find a perkier song. All right, this is a little better, but this one's a little sad. Perfect, the monkeys. I love the monkeys. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. All right, here we are at the Dollar Tree. Let's get inside, guys. He's going to knock you out of the way. Okay, guys, let's get ourselves inside this Dollar Tree. What do you say? Let's go. Ooh, friends, look what we just found right inside the door. These are the like Lego knockoffs, very similar to Legos, but look at their the little birds. These are adorable. Ooh, I need to pick some of these up. My adult son loves to build Legos, so I'm going to ask him to build these for me. Have any of you tried this wood carving set? It's four pieces by Crafters Square. I'm afraid it's an accident waiting to happen, to tell you the truth with me. I don't know. Ooh, and we're finally finding the DIY felting needle kits here. Look at that. It comes with everything you need. And it makes an adorable little key ring. This one is an avocado. And here they have the apple, too. Ooh, I think I really like the apple one. This peach one, though, is making me giggle. I know, so immature, but it looks like a well-endowed derriere. <laughs> and here are more new finds. Look at this box of fabric, but it is velour. This feels really soft. Ooh, I love these colors. They're very, like, jewel-toned, aren't they? Look at the purple and the gray. But the yellow, I think, for Easter. And then, of course, there's red and green if you want to get a jump start on maybe some holiday crafting. I like it when I can find some more prints that are a little bit masculine, like this little bag here, because it could be used for a shave kit. But all of the prints, of course, are unisex, and I don't think you can go wrong with any of these little bags. Ooh, I found a third scent of the Cher body spray here. This one is the 60s decade. Ooh, I do love that orange packaging. But guys, I have my two full bottles that I really love to use up. So have any of you tried it? Let me know if I'm making a mistake by not picking this one up too. I don't recall seeing this before either. It's by Be Pure. It's called Fly Away. And it is a little finishing um, like gel to put in place your fly away maybe baby hairs. This Bolero body wash is jumping out at me. This one is lotus flower and bamboo. You get eight fluid ounces. Ooh, and here is a watermelon and raspberry. That sounds good. What's back here? Cactus pear and avocado. That's different. And they also have a cool mint and eucalyptus. They all sound quite refreshing. Lately, I've been seeing more of these baby bottles at the Dollar Tree. This is a five ounce size and they have it in pink and they have it in blue. And I also see white back here. Those would probably make nice uh, donation items also. And this is a larger one. This is probably, I don't know, 9, 10 ounces. It's Mickey Mouse and, of course, Minnie Mouse also. That one says Glam Girl on it. And then here is a moisturizing hand and body foam soap 
for the kiddos. These look fun, different colors with different scents. They'd make nice little Easter basket fillers. Ooh, blue mascara. I'm telling you, the blue eyeliner and mascara is making a comeback. And I've tried purple myself, and surprisingly, I like it. It was not what I expected. And look at this is a huge, beautiful spring eyeshadow palette. I think my granddaughter would love that, just as she would love these bobby pins. These are very summery. They do look a little large, though. This headband looks very luxe. I don't know. I love the look of headbands, but sometimes they bother, like, because I wear glasses, so where they hit behind my ears. And look at how sweet these are. I could picture little girls wearing these for their first communions or if they're guests at anniversary parties or a wedding. I mean, how pretty. It looks like we have hit the jackpot. Do you guys see this bookshelf? This is a gorgeous hard-covered book. I love giving books as gifts, and at $1.25, these are fantastic. Look at this, Tiny But Mighty. Oh, this is a book about rescuing kittens. Wow. This looks like a lot of fun if you're a kitten lover. How sweet. Great illustrations. Here's something new. A manga drawing book. Ooh, Master the Art of Manga. This would be great for an Easter basket for a tween, I think. Look at that. Has all the directions and space for you to create your own drawings. This one too, pop art. How fun is this? That'd be great for colored pencil work. These are really nice. And they're all $1.25. Ooh, Alberry Books. Now, I believe that these books are sold uh, on Scholastic. These are the type of books that my grands get at the school book fairs. This one looks really nice. Fish Don't Play Ball. That's cute. Ooh, and for the little bit older kids, this Nancy Drew Diaries. Yeah, Simon and Schuster, those are definitely sold at the Scholastic Book Fairs, but more than a dollar twenty-five, I'll tell you that. Here's another great one. Ooh, I think my granddaughter would like this. Not playing by the rules. It's all females in sports. That's funny. I was just thinking about um, Nancy Kerrigan and uh, Tanya, was it Tanya Harding just the other day? I saw something pop up on Facebook about them. And here's another great one, Battle Board. Again, hard covered. These make great gifts. Get them now while you see them and put them away for birthdays or Christmas. Man's Fourth Best Hospital. Another hard covered book. Ooh, this one looks really nice, too. Again, all wonderful books. And look at that. That was $15.95. It includes a reading guide, too. More fun ones for the little ones. And I believe this Callie Lou, is that how you say it? They have a television series. So this, I'm sure, would be very popular if you have grandchildren. Now, I have never seen books like this. Look at that, Taking Care of Yourself. They have a whole little series here. These look like something that would maybe be used in schools even. Am I Sick tells you all about going to the doctor, it looks like. Oh, and little activities. 
These are very nice. I'm impressed. This is a cool new series. And here's one, Stay Clean, about the importance of good hygiene. This is a nice little series. And I think I have found all of them. So you could get the whole collection at Dollar Tree. All right, and I know you like your notebooks as much as I do. I mean, this one, isn't it making you smile with the rainbow and the clouds? And that label peels off so you have the design on both sides. And we might as well check out some pens to go with our notebooks, shouldn't we? I know we all love to make our lists with our pens and our pencils. And look at all these fun colors. And I do like a gel pen. Now, there's lots of gel pens by Jot in different packaging, different quantities. Look at this fun calligraphy pen by Jot. I have one of these that... Uh, my dear friend here on YouTube gifted me last year. I have a lot of fun with it. And we are a sticker loving bunch. Look at these. They look like mylar balloons. They're big and puffy, bright and sparkly. And some new party plates. You get 14. They're shaped like dinosaur and the color on these are great. These are perfect to feed my grands a little treat when they're visiting Mimi and Billy's house. Now I'm not sure if Bill needs any more of these plant clips, but these things are awesome and there's other uses to use them for besides plants. Look at these, they're always cute. I love to just take a peek at the little garden section. Let us see what is new. Or maybe some of you have missed it before, so I know a lot of you do like your little gnomes and your garden statues. Look at these beautiful garden stones. I own some of these myself. And after a year or two outside in this upstate New York weather, they do need replacing. This one is sweet. Be kind. Yes, always a good message. Oh, that's cute too. My grandson kids always say, you say cute a lot, but I can't help it. Now the word for this is substantial. Look at this kayak made for Barbie dolls. This thing is huge. And they also... Um, do they have, is this a different style? No, this looks like a kayak also. Ooh, three pieces, so it even comes with the little oars. Now, tic-tac-toe may be considered an old-fashioned game, but let me tell you guys, my grandson especially loves this, and I do not let him win. He is great at tic-tac-toe. And here's another really fun activity to do with the grands. This is Play-Doh because often the parents aren't thrilled about having Play-Doh at their house. So this is the perfect activity to do at the grandparents. And these are some fun new sets and toys like this really let the kids explore their creativity. I think my grands love to play what they call shop or restaurant. And so they will ask Bill and I what we want to eat. And then they have great fun making it out of Play-Doh and serving it to us, taking our order. So it's a lot of fun. And at $1.25 for these little kits, it makes it affordable to pick up and keep at our house. Oh, and look at this. Here is a, another design. This one is a jet ski this time for your Barbie doll. You know, any fashion doll that's the size of Barbie would work in this. And they do say these are for ages three and up. 
All right, what do you say we check out the pet aisle, see if there's anything here for our fur babies. Some chicken wrapped sweet potato biscuits. Now these are made in China, it says. So I do like to let you all know where the pet uh, food products especially are made. And right next to the pet products are the socks. So this Dollar Tree is well stocked with all of the fun sock designs. They have the men's Christmas boxers in stock. But we've all looked at that before, so let's move on to another section. Ooh, here's something new for us, macrame cord. Boy, does this feel quality. You get 25 yards. Look at that gorgeous gray. And then this is what I would call a camel. I love that color too. Is this black or navy? I would say that one is black. Wouldn't you? Yeah, I think it's black. Very nice and some more of the chest chenille they're calling it yarn here 65 yards all of these soft beautiful colors and they have worsted that's a tough one to say yarn very pretty soft colors so worsted and chenille all different styles here is a tweed yarn and then what is this? Ooh, this is the natural jute cord. This one looks very nautical, doesn't it? Actually, this one too, with the navy and the off-white. And then this is like a brown and white. And I promised Bill we would all check out the food for him. He asked us to grab him one of his modern pantry melts. So, had to make sure we didn't forget his milk. And let's see if we see anything else new that we can't live without. I don't know. Is there anything we missed that you need to pick up, guys? All right, we found a lot of new cuteness in there. Oh, so many different things tempting me, guys. I did try to stick to my list, though, but I'll be sharing everything I did pick up in uh, an upcoming Dollar Tree haul. Don't go anywhere, friends, because once I get home, I'm going to share some fabulous viewer friend photos with you all. So stick around for those. Please enjoy these fabulous viewer friend photos sent in to me from Marianne to share with you all. Thank you, Marianne, for sharing your kitty and all of your crafty, creative talent with us all here. I will include my email at the end here if anybody would like to send me off some JPEGs to share in an upcoming video. And I thank you all for hanging out with me today. You are all just the best friends a gal could ask for. So I will be back again tomorrow with more Dollar Tree fun. And remember our friends, until then, please be well.